get started, we're going to come into a, a lunge with our right leg back. So you're going to step your right leg back. Bring the back knee down, untuck your toes, hands come up to your hips, and we're just going to sink our hips forward and hold here. Gonna hold for another 15 seconds like this. You're going to fold forward, let your fingertips come to the floor, send your hips back, your toes pop up. You're going to have a hamstring stretch on your left leg. We'll hold here for 30 seconds. Try to keep your back nice and long. Natural arch stays in your low back, so you feel the stretch more in your leg instead of your back. Gently bring the weight back to your front foot so you can step it back and you're going to switch sides. So you step your right foot forward now and lunge in the other side. Drop the back knee, untuck your toes, bring your hands to your hips and start to sink forward. Adjust your stance as you need to, looking for a stretch at the front of this left leg. Hold 20 more seconds like this. And you're going to fold over that front leg, let your fingers come down, and send your hips back, right toes pop up. If you can't comfortably reach the ground here, you can gently bring your hands up so your chest can come out. Nice long back, and hold. more seconds like this. And then start to shift the weight forward so you can pick up that back knee. Step back into your plank and we're going to come into pigeon on the left side. So you're going to bring the left knee to your left thumb just as needed. And you have the option to lower yourself down that feels good. We're going to hold this one for a full minute so you can really find yourself a comfortable spot here. If there's ever any pinching or pain, just gently come out of it. Twenty seconds left. Gently start to bring yourself up with your hands. We're going to step back to a down dog just to pedal our feet out, loosen the hips up. And then we're going to 
set that up on the other side. So this time, take your right knee up towards your right thumb. Set yourself up nice and comfortable. Try to square your hips to the front. And then again on this side, you can lower all the way down if you'd like. And we'll hold for one minute. about 10 seconds left. Slowly start to bring your chest off the ground. Support yourself with your hands and right back into that down dog. One last little pedal. Then we'll come to a child's pose. Your knees are out, toes are in. Drop your hips back. Walk your hands forward and let your chest and your forehead come to the floor. Last stretch. We'll hold for 30 seconds like this. Start to use your hands as support as you bring yourself up to a kneeling position. You can end your workout there or add in any other stretches. Thanks for joining.